Hi guys, it's always Gabby, and today I'm going to be packing my tack trunk for shows, for 2019 shows, because we're going to a lot of shows this year. <laughs> It was our first show series and we did not know what we were doing. But this year it's all different because we know what we're doing, kind of. Alright, let's get started packing my trunk. I have the Husky Toolbox. I find it big and it holds all my stuff. Plus you could lock it up like with these or lock it, lock it up. What I like about it is that it is huge. And it has this little caddy that I can remove easily. And also the handle, I can put my saddle on it or I could put this on it. Boy, do I use that because this thing is packed. First in is my show. Next is our cooler that we got. Would you believe that we've never ever used this yet? It's still kind of cold here. It's not like the cooler that you use to cool down your horse in like winter. It's like a cooler for shows and and you could put it on in the morning when it's all foggy and stuff for your show. Yeah, ask Fiona. She told us to get it so we did. put all the soft stuff on the bottom so that nothing hard on the bottom will like break if it gets banged around. The third thing in there is going to be my bat. This is the only... It went right there. This is the only crop that we're allowed to use in a show except for like dressage whips and like dressage shows. Because here it's either use this or none and you can't use it for flat in the shows. You can only use it for like jumping and or poles and don't whack yourself in the eye with it. There. Next we have a very messy grooming thing grooming box. So basically these are all the brushes that we're gonna need. I just threw them in there because my brushes are in the trailer and my tack box and the trailer is closed. So these are the brushes that we will be using. Next thing, we have a sponge because after we're done like the show, we like to hose them down. And we have our grooming supplies in our bag that we got and the bag hangs up. So in here, we have fly spray because my horse goes crazy if there's one. Next, we have show machine. You gotta have show machine. Like, makes your horse all shiny. Then we have hand sanitizer, which we will be like the only people that are prepared with hand sanitizer. And wet wipes in the same thingy. You never know when you're gonna need some wet wipes. The last thing that we have in here is Lexol Quick Wipes. And I got these for my birthday and they are great for emergency tack cleaning. It's a wet wipe for your boots or tack. Like, Boots, bridle, and saddle. Nothing is worse than getting to the show and your horse won't drink. Well, actually, there's something much worse at the show. Memorizing your course. Well, courses. And then having a heart attack when you forget the last jump in the first course when you've been studying it all day, but then you look around and then you see the jump and you're like, oh, okay, never mind. I'm good. I almost got disqualified from there for a minute. But we are bringing some electrolytes with us because who knows what can happen to Finn because we are bringing Finn and Storm is perfect. He drinks. He loves to drink at his shows.
Next, we are bringing a first aid kit. This is not for us. Well, maybe it is for us, but um, you never know when somebody's horse is gonna get hurt. In this one, we have bandages, sponges, and vet wrap and gloves. We are also bringing our cute swimsuit. And in this one, we have iodine, ACE, antibiotic cream, syringes, and needle. Another needle and a huge syringe. And, and banamine. So these are all the things that we keep in our first aid kit just for emergencies. I am bringing this big bucket for random stuff. So I'm going to put all of our first aid stuff in there. And I'm also bringing our favorite horse treat, Martin's treat, which are going in here. And a food bowl, which we use for like giving Storm medicine and stuff when he hurt his foot. But now it's all cleaned out and we can use it for treats since we didn't want the treats to go everywhere. Next up, I'm going to bring a water bucket. We are also going to bring like a bigger water bucket. So I'm putting a sponge and my extra halter because Storm uses um, a leather halter with a shipping helmet on it. So I always have to have an extra halter. So I'm bringing the plum lead rope that matches the plum halter. We have this white spray paint for horses' legs. And I use it for storm socks. Next, we take a bunch of towels because you can never have too many towels. We have a pin. It's actually my pin, which I lost last year. Nice. We have a hairnet. We have braiding yarn for Finn. This is already cut. And we also have braiding yarn for Storm. Have you guys ever tried this? Let me know in the comments below. But it's this horse razor shaver thingy. And it looks like this. Be careful, do not rub your finger on that to try to get all the dirt off because I cut my thumb on it before. It hurts. <laughs> um, yeah, it cuts whiskers. And I know you guys are, are against like cutting whiskers, but here in Canada, our shows like to show you need to cut your horse's whiskers. So this is so much better than having an electric razor. It's so easy. And even my sister can use it. Next, we have my sister's ribbons for her hair. Because until you're 12, you're allowed to wear ribbons. Why didn't I know that last year? I could have got extra points for being cute. We bring a needle and thread for emergencies. Scissors, two pairs, you never know. We have a leather hole puncher. Yeah, I use this to punch new holes in my belt. That's the only reason why we use it. We use this just in case if we need to resize any of our tack like Styles Martindale. Next, we have a clip. It's good for hanging up water buckets and stuff. So we have tack cleaner, travel size tack cleaner. It works well. Cowboy Magic, which we actually got this from Willow's old owner. She gave it to us and she said that she used it on, like that she uses it on Willow's mane, and it works so well for like tails and mane. It's amazing. Get this stuff. Lastly, we have all of our show gloves. And yes, it's a mess, but it's fine. Mine. Oh, look, here's my noble outfitters. I, I lost these a long time ago. They've been in my tack trunk all along. I'm like, what? But these are my show gloves, which they're gorgeous. I love them. It's like, yes. Ah. They still fit. 
Last year they were a tiny bit tighter on my fingers, but now they're looser. Okay. So our trailer will hold like our um, bridal, saddle, martingale, all that stuff. Last year we didn't have a trailer, so we had to put all that stuff in our tack trunk, except for the saddle, because imagine that. So this is it. I am really happy with how it looks. I think we have everything we need and comment down below if you think of something that we don't have because the show is in like two days but by the time you see this the show is tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. That's a wrap.